In this science project, you'll create your own hydroponic systems and test if plants really need soil or just the nutrients that soil provides. This project now comes with a kit containing all of the materials you need, or you can source these materials yourself from local stores. There are a few items that are not in the kit that you likely already have at home. To start this experiment, you'll first need to mark along the upper lip of the bottle to indicate where you will cut it. Then you will use a scissors or knife to cut along the marking around the bottle. Invert the top, placing the opening downward into the bottom half of the bottle. The bottom half will hold the water or nutrient rich water, while the top will hold the coconut core and seeds to grow the plants. Next, obtain a piece of cotton to create the wick system. Tie a piece of cotton twice, forming a knot in the middle of the cotton strip and two tails to form a wick. After you've created the wick system, Insert the wick's tails through the opening of the bottle until the knot stops at the opening and the tails flow freely below it. Prepare your nutrient solution by measuring one half of a teaspoon of liquid nutrient solution and pour it into a liter of water. Invert the bottle three times to mix the solution or until it's homogeneous. Prepare your no nutrient negative control bottle by measuring 190 ml or 6.5 fluid ounces of water per bottle. Pour the 190 ml of water over the top of the knot, allowing it to wet the entire cotton wick and trickle down into the bottom of the apparatus. Next, you'll measure the same volume of 190 ml of the diluted nutrient solution to add to your with nutrients condition bottle. Pour the nutrient solution over the wick just as you did for the without nutrients condition. Now you'll rehydrate two pellets of coconut core in 100 ml of water for every two bottles. Wait about two to three minutes for the coconut core to absorb the water. Then gently mix it with your measuring spoon so that it has a similar consistency throughout the material. Carefully transfer about half of the coconut core into one of the two bottles. Fill them with the coconut core to the top edge or lip of the bottle. Next, you'll plant the seeds into the coconut core. Before you plant your seeds, use the end of your permanent marker or pen to make a small indent about one eighth of an inch deep to the top of the rehydrated coconut core in each hydroponic container. Then carefully drop one seed into each indentation and cover it with excess or extra coconut core. Lastly, in your experimental setup, You'll cover the bottles with foil to prevent algae from growing inside the bottom of the container. Tape it closed to ensure that no light is able to get in. Now that you set up your experiment, you'll observe and record the plant growth over time in the nutrient and nutrient deficient conditions. Use your results from this experiment to determine if soil or just nutrients are necessary for plant growth. For more information on how to perform this experiment yourself, check out our written instructions at the link in the description. Thanks for watching and see you next time.